Hi, it's Martin. For today's DIY project, I was inspired by my co-designer and assistant here, Roma. She's a Papillon princess, almost two years old. As we know, pets are part of the family too, right? And they deserve to have their own furniture and decorative accessories to make them feel at home, which is how I came up with this custom doggy daybed for the pampered pooch of the house. In this case, Roma. Right, Mama? Mwah. Materials needed, a suitcase, dimensions will depend on the size of your four-legged fur baby, small bun feet, flat washers and hex nuts, removable wallpaper, crate cushion, spray paint, cordless drill and a 5 16th inch drill bit, utility blade, L-bracket, pliers, and a quarter inch MDF board and double-sided tape are optional. Let's begin by attaching a bun foot on each corner that I spray painted pink, which is a perfect color for a princess. They sell these top plates that you can twist the bun foot on, but the screws are too long for the thickness of the suitcase, and I certainly don't want to have a sharp point sticking out that can be a safety issue for Roma. Instead, the solution is to drill a hole with a 5 16 inch drill bit and secure the foot from the inside with a washer and hex nut. That wasn't too bad, right Roma? Go ahead and remove any of the suitcase lining to make sure the hex nut screws on tightly. Tighten the hex nut with pliers. We are now ready to decorate my favorite part, right Roma? So the suitcase will remain open the entire time, which means this back portion becomes the wall in Roma's new retreat. And at the moment it looks like a black hole, not very attractive. So I want to give it a designer look with this removable wallpaper. Do you like it, Roma? Nice, right? This tropical leaf pattern is very Palm Beach chic and works with the white and pink color scheme. I'm not installing the wallpaper directly on the back portion because I feel it's gonna be harder to make clean cuts around the edges. And as you know by now, I'm a perfectionist. <laughs> so I do have a better solution. I'm sticking the wallpaper on a quarter inch piece of MDF board that I'm using as an insert. Smooth out any air bubbles as you stick the wallpaper on and trim with the blade. Then I use double sided tape to hold it in place. This also makes it easy to switch out should Roma ever want to update her decor. Roma's already tired and I'm doing all the work. I don't get it. But take a look at this. Amazing, right? I love it. Now to prevent the suitcase lid from closing, I'm installing an L bracket right near the hinge, which locks it in place. The final touch is to personalize the daybed with a photo of Roma inside her frame. And once again, I'm using double-sided tape and add a comfy crate cushion. All right, here comes the moment of truth. Roma, do you approve? Yes? She's so spoiled and that's okay. She gives us so much unconditional love every single day and this is my way of showing you, Roma, how much I love you by creating this luxury lounger for the princess of the house. I even have this pillow with her name on it to make it super comfy. There you go. <laughs> I had so much fun creating this DIY doggy bed out of a suitcase and I hope you enjoyed watching it. I'm Martin, this is Roma, and I'll see you next time.